male minus 67 kilogram, the second of the bronze medals. Georgios Meliotis of Greece, fifth in Cairo in the Karate One Premier League. He's been third on two occasions in the Youth League, hasn't won at European or World level. Boron Berak, six Yuko, four Wasari, three Ippon. Boron Berak from Croatia, whose father is one of the WKF referees. Ah. Very experienced referee. And lots of support from the home crowd. Just one or two. <laughs> it's absolutely brilliant to see the Croatian team lined up over there with their flags flying to bring on the support for their man. We have 19-year-old Beliotis from Greece up against Barak of Croatia, 27 years of age. We've seen quite a lot of um, Greece in the medal matches. Greece a very, very successful, very strong country and this is turning out to be a, a particularly good European Championships for them. Warren Berek European champion twice before as an under 21 at minus 60 and a junior. He's also been an under 21 bronze medalist. Oh, very quick very front nice. hand from Beliotis. Berra came in for an attack, but the counterpunch from Beliotis caught him out by surprise. He pulled back nicely before delivering it as well. He did. He got out of range from the attack, didn't he? Very and then nice. came back in with the counterpunch. And he'll now receive the century. kick was so fast but he couldn't put it on target he stepped off the tatami he's very fast with his techniques though he's like lightning minus 67 though that's a very very fast weight the lighter weights are got such fast twitch fiber it's even the movement as they're just standing here on, um, just on waiting to attack now so different to the heavier categories Speed is their thing. Mm -hmm. We have Berak once more receiving, a, uh, Baliotis once more receiving a warning for stepping off the tatami. Meliotis stood his ground, but it was Berak this time. Great reaction from the crowd. The support from the judges. Levels to score 1 1. The century still stays with Beliotis. Great attempt there from Moran Berak for that roundhouse kick, the Mawashi Geri. Aliotis is holding his nose. He thinks he might have been caught with a technique. Referee giving a warning to Berak for contact. High kick attempt there from Aliotis, yeah. and he gets the support from the judges at Yoko Geri. 
seen a lot more Europe games these days than we used to many a and few it's years used, back. It's used often, isn't it, in the last few seconds yeah. to stop the opponent coming forward and you having to take a, a, an unnecessary jogai. But you're right, Helen. Side kick, kick is coming well. back in again. It's a powerful kick. Yes, indeed. Baliotis of Greece leading three points to one against Boron Barak. Barak puts him in the corner. The video review request from the coach of Boron Barak. Let's see what is being considered here. And it's a kick over the top and there's a punch. There's a punch from Aliotis. Does the kick score? Drops over the top and then puts the kick in. You can't really see from that no. side, can you? We'd have to have a different view perhaps to see where the kick actually landed. But red has not scored and neither has blue. So this time Baliotis tries again that punch. Forty-five seconds still to go. Oren Berak still putting pressure on his man to try and get back into contention. Can still be done. Forty seconds, just under forty seconds on the clock. Yep, still plenty of opportunity for scores. Berak told to put his gum shield back in. That's another warning. Goes for a side kick attack. Punch is going all over the place here. Seen a lot more attacks coming in on this, this fight than previous ones. I think Berak has found himself trailing. In his view, he uh, rather surprisingly. But Baliotis is just so fast. That was better from Berak. He managed to get the range right that time. And now he's within striking distance. Baliotis has got to maintain his focus and concentration here and not let Barak back into this match. As we go into the last 20 seconds, this time is. Aliotis who goes for a high punch. And the coach of Berak believes that there was a score. Berak receives a warning. Another point for Baliotis. Four points to two, just 12 seconds left on the clock. I think this is going to get really interesting. Time running out for Barak. Still trying desperately to score. Baliotis steps off the tatami. Barak has a video review request from the coach. Have a look at the video. We're looking at blue. And Berak forcing his man back and did the kick round the back or to the front. Well, the first one missed, the second one missed, but what about round the back? Did this one score? Was it too low? You can score on the back, but can't score lower than that. So really below the belt? Well, depends on where you wear your belt. You can wear your belt up around your waist, <laughs> couldn't you? But, <laughs> but, it, Fair point. but it has to be on the back. 
rather than on the back. <laughs> if you I'll get let my you drift. finish that one. <laughs> yeah, it mustn't be lower than the back. So one second still on the clock. And the score still in favor of Georgios Beliotis. Beliotis from Greece, just 19 years of age, doing a great job here. But he's going to lose that centum. He stepped off the tatami. Now. Watch for Barak to come off the line. He's got two seconds still on the clock. 2.6 seconds in reality. Oren Berak. Senchu's been lost. Two seconds on the clock. Berak comes storming in, but the front hand of Beliotis is there. Beliotis knew Barak was going to come for him, didn't he, Helen? He just knew that that was the, that was the only option left it at was. this point in time with two seconds. You've got to come in with that kick. You've got to come on. Yeah, so he knew he was coming for him. And what did they say about the best form of defence? Attack. <laughs> Definitely. Five points to two. Point nine of a second. Berak being too vocal for the referee's liking. Even with that point nine of a second, he was still trying. Yes, he was. I think Greece had a great fight. Clever strategy from Baliotis to defeat Moran Berak. Berak was very frustrated during that match. You, you could tell the frustration was getting to him. And also Greece was very much in, in his stance. He'd, his upper body was sat back quite a lot. So it gave his opponent quite a lot more work to do to get yeah, those punches in. Right. Time to celebrate your bronze medal. Very quick, though, with nice. his techniques. This is how he did it. Oh. 